Hey guys, it's Vera Sweeney and I'm doing a live today all about what I got in the mail. Um, lots of stuff. I've been away for a good week and so I thought I would just sort of show you everything as I'm going through it. Now I got these Dove um, exfoliating polishes last week, but I'm not even entirely sure that I included them in any sort of roundup so I just wanted to share them with you guys. It's the um, exfoliating body polish series and they're new. So it's pomegranate seeds with shea butter, it's kiwi seeds with cool aloe, and then it's crushed macadamia and rice milk. I know what the other two smell like. I haven't tested this one out. Let me just give it a smell. I mean Okay, it smells delicious. Right off the bat, you can see they have like this whipped um, but thick consistency. So it's whipped and not so airy. It's definitely dense and thick and creamy and yummy. And I absolutely cannot wait to use this in the shower. These are brand new products. Um, I just received them last week. And it says formulated with the brand Signature Quarter Moisturizer Cream. Dove Exfoliating Body Body Polish Nourishes Skin As You Exfoliate. So that's something to look out for. I'm just going to pop that to the side. Lots of stuff. Um, again, I should have definitely opened these before I started, but let's just go with it. Okay, so first up... Oh, Young Living. Oh, this is interesting. So I had somebody email me about um, Young Living, and I don't work with them. I am not one of those people that sells Young Living, but I am definitely an essentials oil kind of girl. And uh, we were going back and forth. She was the PR girl for the company. And she said, you know, would you mind if I sent you some samples? And I said, absolutely. I would love for you to send me some samples. So um, let's see what this is. This is the diffuser. So it looks like it's a um, one of those wall diffusers, but this is very big. It must not be a wall diffuser. This is huge. Hold on a second. Let's check it out. Let's just open it because I, I'm going to use this, and I'll blog about it because I am very interested in essential oils. I believe there is power in scent, and I believe that there is power in how it affects your mood. So that's why I sort of love diffusers. Okay, so this is what it looks like. And this is the inside. You put some water and then a couple of drops or whatever your favorite scent is. Good stuff. This is Young Living. I'm just going to put it back in the box for now and open up and see what kind of scents they sent along. So Young Living Essential Oils. Let's see what kind of scents they sent. Scents they sent. Yes, I did that. Um, it says, please enjoy your, fun, your fan favorites from Young Essential Oils. Okay. So we have Thieves Waterless Hand Purifier, um, and then it also is an essential oil roll-on. And then we have, oh, I can't see it because it's under, oh, here, Lavender. I love Lavender. And what is this little thing over here? Let me take this out so we can take a look. This looks like, oh, it says grapefruit lip balm. So they also have lip balm. So they gave me a lavender essential oil, and then they gave me a lip balm so I can use. They have a bunch of different products. I, I actually thought it was just the essential oils that you put into the diffuser. Turns out there's other things here as well. So um, we have a hand purifier, stress away. Let me see if I can open this. I love this like I can't. Oh, wait, I have a knife. Um, I love that they have this like seal of approval over here to show that it's it's actually one of their products. Oh, so this must be, oh, this is an essential roll-on. Yeah, this is fabulous. Get it started. Okay, I'm like, I'm already obsessed. I'm, I'm, I'm two seconds into my experience with Young Living um, essential oils, and they have already sold me as a client. So... I'll do a little recap on that in the blog. I actually really am excited about getting my hands on this product because I've seen a lot of people that I know um, talk about it, sell it, work with it, and I've never firsthand worked or touched or smelled or felt any of their products. So this was a great um, opportunity for me to do so. So as you know, once a month, um, Elf usually sends me some, some stuff. 
And I always love to show you what they have because e.l.f. is one of those brands that, um, you know, you don't have to spend a lot of money to have a good experience with makeup. I mean, I've said this story a hundred times. Uh, on Black Friday, I, I, I used to, they don't really have this sale anymore, but what I used to do is I used to go to the e.l.f. website online and I used to buy five or six under, um, you know, eye, eye makeup, eyeliners, and they were all a dollar, and I would use them all year long. So, you know, the, the, the fact, the lie, the, the story that magazines are telling you that you have to spend $25 to get a really good looking under eye, you know, anything, it's just not true. So, Elf is, Elf is sort of one of those brands that I like because the price is right, the point, you know, it's for everybody, it's beauty for everybody, and I, I really stand behind that. So, this is Elf Christian Siriano. So, they have a new collaboration with Christian Siriano, and um, inspired by his spring 2018 collection. And if you want to learn more about that, you can go to hashtag Elf Heart Christian, Elf Hearts Christian with an S. So let's see what we have here. We have tinted lip oil, which I'm interested, so let's give it a go. Oh, Jennifer says, uh, lavender oil, tangerine, and grapefruit are all her favorite. That's good to know. Whenever I get my nails done, Jennifer, I ask for the orange oil, while everyone else pretty much asks for the lavender. Um, I'm always, or the eucalyptus, I'm always like, hi, can I have the orange? So this is the pink, right to my daughter. It's a little too pink for me. But, um, you know, if I, I'm not, I'm not, I don't usually wear bright colors like this, but you can see, I just rubbed it in. It is a really soft pink. Let's give it a shot just because um, it's really, really a, a light pink. Subtle, moisturizing, it gives the right tint that you need, perfect for the summer or spring. Um, I like it. And oh, this is Electric Fuchsia. This is for a girl's night out, ladies. I don't even have to see this color, and I know this is a girl's night out color. Electric Fuchsia. I wish my personality was Electric Fuchsia. So this is definitely a lot more bolder. Here we are, wow. Big, big wow here. This is if you're going out, you know, you wanna make a big um, statement. If you go heavy on the lip, you don't have to go heavy on the eye. That's the general rule of thumb. But when I go out, I go heavy everywhere because that's just who I am. Okay, so lip full exfoliator. I don't use these enough. I was actually having a conversation with somebody. I was away and we were talking about tools. What tools do you use to exfoliate your lip? And I was like, my fingernail? Like, I don't use tools. I don't pay for exfoliation for my lip. I go like this and I exfoliate my lip. But... This type of stuff I like because you can just keep this in your bag. It sort of feels a little bit sandy. It feels like an exfoliator. And again, e.l.f. is the price is right. So um, it's just a great product. And as I'm, um, you know, I put, it, it's nude, so you don't really see it. And as I'm rubbing it, it almost feels like you have a little bit of salt and olive oil on your hands. And it's just a great reminder to every now and then exfoliate your lips. I had a big conversation with my kids last night. They are all dehydrated. And you know, number one, everyone should be drinking. I mean, if, you, if your skin is dehydrated, you're not drinking enough liquid. So, um, but if you get there and you want to exfoliate, um, this is a good option. And then, you know, you just really have to stay on top of it. This is a great thing to have. So there's a lot of people that use like that lip sense and the stuff that keeps it, that keeps the color on your um, lips for 12 hours and things like that. I don't particularly um, use those products because I don't like, it's just like too committed for me. Like I get nervous. Like if I, maybe I don't want my lipstick on for 12, 12 hours. I just, it's a, I'm like a commitment fold when it comes to color like that. But this is a lip color remover. So if you are one of those girls that likes to have the lipstick that you can keep on all day long, and then you're really looking to end it and you want to take it off, um, they have a lip color remover from Elf that you can just use to help get rid of the color that you have on your lips. So I do like that. And then primer, ladies, Xavier X. I haven't seen you in forever. Um, and then the lip, the lip primer is um, really great. Um, women of a certain age, you have to start using primer for everything. You have to use it for your skin. You have to use it for your eye makeup. 
If you have to use it for your lips, our skin just doesn't become um, as absorbent as it used to be. We become much drier, and so the makeup just falls off much easier. If you notice by 12 o'clock your makeup is all off of your face, it's because you're not using primer. So if you use primer, it'll help you keep your makeup on longer. So that's my additional tip. See, I do unboxings, but I also tell you all the stuff that I know inside of my head. Okay, so here we go. I don't know what this is. Oh, stainless steel mixing balls. This is Audrey. Um, okay, this is something that Audrey sent me. So I'm not going to talk about this. I'm going to let this go. All right, let's keep going. Oh, Vince. Okay, so listen to this. So I have an American Express credit card. And I got an email, and Vince is like a pretty expensive brand. I don't normally shop here. And they said, um, because you are an American Express credit card holder, we want to give you $100 free credit to Vince, whatever you want to um, use. No minimum required. And so I bought, I ended up being able to buy two different pieces from Vince. And I did go to the sales section, and I was trying to figure it out. But I ended up getting... A very basic comfortable white tee um, it's it's three-quarter sleeve I don't know if you can tell it's one of those like really loosey-goosey oh it's long sleeve sorry loosey-goosey super casual everyday wear tee and then I ended up with an olive green tee great feel of the fabric um, simple. I just went really simple because I didn't want to go over my hundred mark. Um, this is a $75 t-shirt and this is a $115 t-shirt, a uh, sweat, a uh, shirt. I got them on sale, was able to buy them both for about $80 and, um, thank you American Express. That is not sponsored. That is just, I've uh, just because I was an American Express card holder that came my way so let's see what this is this is jojo mama bean now i've worked with this woman for the last five years this is somebody that's out of europe and they sell clothes in the u.s great clothes for kids a lot of, of caleb's um actually longer than five years because I used to get clothes for Natalie and Liam from her website for the holidays so this is a this is a great website if you're looking for clothing for kids maybe um, 10 T and under uh, my my older two no longer fit in this brand but this is a great brand I Caleb's all his Christmas present uh, pictures he was wearing these clothing so he's oh she just wrote me a note I hope you and the family are well here are a, a few new pieces from our, our brand new collection so this is a size five six, and you can see what I'm talking about. It's just so much fun. You know, he loves dinosaurs. This is something that he'll definitely want to wear in school. And I'm telling you, the fabrics are thick. It's high quality. You can wash this a whole bunch of times, and um, no problems whatsoever. Again, another fabulous. Look at this. This is so cute. A little dinosaur um, hoodie. And on one side, it's the, um, you can see his little face, his dinosaur face, and he has a little dinosaur mouth over here. She's just very creative when it comes to design. Again, super great fabric. This is great for presents if you have anybody that is in your family that are, that are young and are looking for, um, you know, holiday gifts, Christmas gifts, birthday gifts. I always tell my friends to go to this site. And then for the pants, um, we have shorts here, five, six again. And this is 17 pounds. Um, it doesn't say the U.S. comparative. I wish I knew that, like, right off the hand. It's it's just, I don't remember what it what the conversion is, but it's not much more than that. And, again, it's just really, you know, you wash it, the color stays. I've been, I've been definitely shopping this brand for a really, really long time since Natalie can fit in it. And she's an adult medium at this point, so that gives you an idea of how long I've been with them. So, uh, Jojo Mama Bebe, J-O-J-O-M-A-M-A. N B E B E excellent. I'll actually add a little uh, link to that when I'm done, just so you get a gist of it. This is super heavy. I have no idea what this is. Let's see. Oh, I think I know what this is. Hold on. I'm just 
like throwing boxes aimlessly. Okay, so in December, yes, in December, I thought that's what this, that's what this was. Um, Johnson's baby, Johnson's company, they gifted me a photography session with somebody on Long Island for them to come to my house and just shoot my family, photograph my family, um, very casually, not staged, just us sort of living our lives. And the woman, let's see, I can't, I hope her name is in the front because I'm not going to remember it off the top of my head. Hold on one second. The woman who came, oh gosh, I'm going to add her link. But the woman who came literally just followed us around room by room and she quietly took pictures of us just playing board games. Um, you know, she really did such a great job. We, you know, just sitting in the living room, uh, we baked cookies, we had lunch, we, you know, even, even the tiniest moments, you know, she captured all these really beautiful moments. And this was the first time that I had ever done a photojournalistic uh, photography session. I've never done something like this before. Like, you know, Liam had changed his shirt and I, I was just changing, I was helping him with his collar and, you know, she snapped these quick moments like this. Maria, I love these kind of pictures too. And, you know, it wasn't intrusive. She stayed with us for just a few hours. Absolutely fantastic. Her, um, Bill, you don't remember the name of the photographer, do you? It's Francesca something. It's killing me. This came from her. This came from her. Um, the company she prints from. That's why it doesn't have her actual. Francesca Russell.com. Francesca Russell.com. She is a Long Island based. She does New York City, tri state area. If you are in this vicinity, Francesca Russell.com. Again, I will add that link definitely so you can check out her work. And um, Johnson and Johnson, Johnson's baby, gifted me that that session with her for Christmas and so it really was a beautiful thing and this is sort of one of those gifts that I, I will have this photo book forever because truly I don't know the last time I printed a photo book I mean it's been years since I printed a photo book so to have her there um, it really was amazing now this I bought myself I was on a trip out in LA and I was telling everybody how tight my shoulders were because I really did, I was having a really hard time with one of my shoulders. I'm, I'm constantly stressed. I have high anxiety. And one of the women there was like a masseuse and she said, well, do you have, um, do you have cups? And I was like, no, I don't have cups. Like, what are you talking about? And she was like, oh, you could do this yourself. She was like, I put them right on my shoulder and I do them myself. And she was like, it's like 20 bucks on Amazon. They're the best thing you'll ever get. After you take the cups off, she's like, you will feel so relaxed. You don't need anybody to help you with them. You could do them yourself. I went with her with my Amazon app and I was like, show me what to buy. And she said, this one's fine. And it was like 1995, something along the lines. And basically, you, you know, it pulls, it just, I don't even, it is a little, it is a little scary, Sandra. Like, I didn't realize that this was happening. I, I don't know what I visualized when I bought these cups. But I'm going to try this and I'm going to let you know. Maybe we'll even do a YouTube video on it so I can let you guys see it firsthand. But um, I'm going to give this a shot because basically what I want to do is I want to put it over here. This is where I have, like, the most stress. Like, whenever I go get my nails done, um, the woman's always like, oh, you're so stressed, you're so stressed. And I'm like, I know, I know I'm stressed. You're making me more stressed just talking about it. Okay, L'Oreal, we're, we're, we're schmoozing along. We're moving along over here. So L'Oreal is another brand that I absolutely love working with and for. For some reason, I got on their L'Oreal Paris mailer, which is great because they always send me um, the latest and greatest in makeup so let's see what came out first of all look at this box adorable I guess I have to actually undo it I'm actually undoing the box okay so I have to undo all the little things okay so now we are, we're up to L'Oreal and let's see what we have inside okay fiber Fiber mascara, no falsies, no extensions, just fiber. So they're coming out with X Fiber. 
Um, they, they sent this to me, compliments of L'Oreal. It's a two-step fiber system, unique black primer, and um, there's extreme length and volume for each lash. No falsies needed. So let's just try to go through everything and see um, what we have. So this is called Superstar X Fiber. And then these are the new um, eyeliners. Now, again, this is another great brand that I want to speak to. Their eye pencils are, does this, I have to sharpen it? No, I don't. Wait, do I? Is this going up? No, it's not. Perfect. So this you can manipulate with the bottom. It comes in a variety of colors. They have brown, blue, uh, black, I guess real black, a uh, gray, purple, and then the beige. Now for the beige, if you ever want to open up your eye, you use the beige. So the black you can do on the top and on the bottom. Um, the beige, if you do in the under eye and underneath your lid, this will help open up your eye. If you ever feel that your eyes are too small, the lighter um, eyeliners will help uh, open and extend the look of your eyes. So this is sort of a makeup play. So that's why they have the, the two different colors here. Um, let me see what color this is. Yeah, this is nude beige. That's what they're calling it. So once you, so we have six different colors for the eye pencils, and then the actual mascara themselves. And then just in case you missed my last live, I still have um, one of the things that I really like that they have sent. They sent me from Elva, El Vive, which is the um, leave-in conditioner. I brought it up from downstairs. I'm gonna I'm gonna use it right now. Actually, I'm about to take a shower. It's the protein recharge leave-in conditioner. I actually have started switching from regular conditioner I only use leave-in conditioner now I just don't care like to be honest with you my hair needs all the help it can get and for me to have that extra power that extra oomph that leave-in conditioner gives me I don't necessarily leave um, I don't leave it in entirely like when I'm in the shower I'll put it in and then I'll wash out like 80% of it because it, for me I have very oily hair and if I leave in the conditioner um, it, it I become very flat and oily and I don't have the type of hair that can leave in a lot of product, even hairspray. Like if I put hairspray in my hair on day one, on day two I have to take a shower. I'm not the type of girl that has the hair that can have a blowout go for four or five days. I just, it doesn't ever work that way. But kudos to people who can. But for me, this is how I use the products. Um, everyone, everyone uses them differently. All right, so. I know what this one is, Land's End. I'm going to be in a bathing suit soon, people. So last year I signed up for Land's End, Land's End bathing suit, and I, I got a bikini, and I don't know what I was thinking because I had to actually post a picture of me in a bikini. And this year I came to my senses and I got a one-piece because I was like, wait a minute, the, 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 the outfit that I request is the outfit I actually have to post. So I was like, no more uh, bikini. So let me see what I opted for. This is a one, this is, oh no, this is the tankini. So I got um, just a regular black tankini. And then I think this is the skirt. And this is the skirt. So I have a little outfit. When I say I go to the beach, I'm not, oh, no, I'm no longer in a bathing suit, I'm in a little outfit. Like this is sort of what I used to wear when I went clubbing when I was 19 years old. Like when I would go clubbing, this is the outfit I would wear to get into the club. And now this is the outfit that I'm wearing to the beach. And that's what 40 years old looks like on me. I mean, everybody's different, but that's what 40 years old looks like on me. So that's my bathing suit that I'm gonna wear for Land's End. And I actually have one more. I don't know what this one is. I have one more. This is my last hurrah. That's Bill's, so I'm not going to open it. This is like our mail room. That's why everything back there is all extra boxes I have to get through, that I have to throw out. Oh, okay, so I'm doing, um, I'm doing a campaign with Best Buy, and they needed to send me the Echo Plus 
So I'm doing a Mother's Day campaign with them. We're going to talk about some of the new features that the Echo Plus has. And I'm just looking to see if I have any more boxes. And I don't think I do. I think I went through them all, thank goodness. So that's it. That's what I got in the mail this last week. That's what happens when I go away. Um, lots of good stuff. I'm going to be um, taking my time and doing some write-ups about some of these items because I think they deserve extra detail. And thank you so much for watching, chatting, passing along. Pay no mind to the chaos that I just created in my office behind me. But um, until next time, bye.